trunk of our new snail while he eats. You'll see one of his eyeballs staring at us now as soon as we get up there. He just gets a little bit shy, so... There you can see his eye. One little eyeball. Usually follows you around a little bit. So that thing sticking out the front is his trunk. There you go, it's coming down. And you'll see him back him up some sand while he tries to eat the algae off. Watch. So what he's basically doing is he's looking for stones that are covered in what's called cyanobacter. It's the red stuff there. You can see how it's suctioning up the sucking up the little bits of sand. And he goes around the whole tank. Yeah, you're showing us your nose. Goes around the whole tank. And just basically everywhere he goes, he has a little look-see. Just tasting it. He's actually different to the other snails. The other snails use... Oh, there you go. You can see his tongue coming out. Can you see? He's trying so hard to get a good quality video. He's just showing off. Um... Yeah, so he's different to the other snails. The other snails figure out where they are by smelling or sniffing or whatever they do. But he actually uses his eyes, so he moves by vision. So there's one eye on the top, and here's the other eye here. There. You can actually see the little pupil and everything. So he's quite big. I'd say he's probably about maybe two centimeters long. Oh, there you go. Good view of the the actual vacuuming action. Hmm? There goes your little mouth inside. Yeah, nice little snail. And then, um, yeah, so that's him. And uh, it's his little vacuuming styles. I'll uh, keep you informed about any new changes or any new, um, any new little movements that he makes. And uh, say goodbye to everybody. Say goodbye, Mr. Snail. Oh, you're still, you're still a baby, you can't talk. There you go, you shut your mouth. There you go, there you go, you're saying goodbye. See, that's lovely. <laughs>